Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, as posted previously, we are expecting the optional bug fix updates to roll out for Windows 10 any day soon, and that's because Microsoft did say that those C-release updates that rolled out near the end of every month would roll out in the fourth week, which is the week we find ourselves in now. And we are also expecting a possible 23H2 feature update release for Windows 11 to be rolled out alongside the optional update for Windows 11 22H2 for October. And we had a look at a couple of reasons why we haven't seen the update yet. And I did post on that and I'll leave that video down below. I posted on that a day or so ago. Now go check that video out to fill in the blanks. But just another quick update because I know a lot of you on the channel are interested in the 23H2 feature update release. And just a little bit more info has come to light, possibly why we are still not seeing the 23H2 feature update. Now, a reason why Microsoft could possibly roll out 23H2 this week, if not this week, uh, starting next week, the 31st, is because um, the history of the Windows 11 feature updates tells us that Microsoft, with the original release version 21H2 and version 22H2, those were both rolled out in October of those relevant years, being 2021 and 2022. So there's a good chance 23H2 will roll out in October of this year, although not confirmed, because Microsoft, all they said was it will be released uh, in the last quarter of this year. Now, as I have posted previously, Microsoft did say that there would be no changes to the hardware and system requirements between version 22H2 and 23H2 of Windows 11. But um, with the Moment 4 feature update, they did update the Windows SDK. Uh, that's the software development kit. That rolled out as part of the Moment 4 feature update, which started rolling out with the optional bug fix update for Windows 11 22H2 at the end of September followed into the beginning of um, October, as I have been posting. And most of the 23H2 features rolled out with the Moment 4. So as I have posted previously, uh, 23H2, I don't think we'll have um, that many new features. There are going to be some improvements, um, but most of the new features rolled out with Moment 4 and not 23H2. So as mentioned, we have already received the Windows Software Development Kit with Moment 4. Now, another reason why this 23H2 feature update has been delayed is because um, Microsoft has now released an updated Windows Driver Kit, WDK, for Windows 11 23H2. And if you don't know what WDK is all about, it provides the tools, according to Microsoft, and samples for creating efficient, high-quality drivers for devices, quote-unquote. So that's Microsoft's definition of the Windows Driver Kit, which apparently now Microsoft um, has released an updated WDK for Windows 11 23H2. So they're obviously trying to take their time with the feature update and possibly um, the reason it hasn't rolled out yet is obviously they are getting that driver kit in order. So we could expect possibly um, a more stable 23H2 and also better driver compatibility. So that's a good thing. So I'd rather Microsoft takes their time and roll out a stable release than roll out a so-called rushed update like a lot of the updates are and then we battle with issues and bugs for months to come now if we don't see the update roll out this week then i would strongly suggest we will see it next week the 31st and if we don't see it the 31st then it will be released for the november patch tuesday update it will roll out on the second tuesday which will be the 14th and then obviously that will also carry on over to uh, that fourth week of the month. So that would be Tuesday the 28th. Now, if we don't see it in November, which I think we will, I don't think Microsoft will roll out the 23H2 feature update um, uh, for the Patch Tuesday update for December. And that's because we get no optional update at the end of December because of the holidays. So as mentioned, if it doesn't come next week, the 31st, then I'm sure it'll come the 14th, if not the 28th, and um, by then it should have all rolled out, and I don't think we'll see it in December because of the holidays. So that's just a quick update 
Um, I know there's a lot going on and sometimes it's actually hard to grasp all this information and relay it out to you so you can actually understand the rollout phase. But nonetheless, as I get this information in, um, I post and let you guys know and I hope it's helpful and um, I know a lot of you, including myself, are expecting 23H2 and as this info comes in, obviously I post and let you guys know. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.